Hey, many fish. Still the 9th of December. And uh, I saw this yesterday, and uh, wow, this is pretty wild, too. It was put out on the 7th at 11.18. 9.11 has to be, right? Pantone's color for 2018 revealed to be ultraviolet. 2018, the 11 year, right? So Pantone, I never heard of them, but apparently they are the uh, trendsetters, I guess you call them, when it comes to the fashion and design world where, where they put out their color of the year. Uh, that's what all the trendy people, all the worldly people shoot for. But there's a lot more meaning to purple. I mean, just this image here we could study, and there are some very interesting things going on here, but I digress. Notice it's always a Getty image as well, you know, Getty. So, New York, what we have here in 2017 is a heap of chaos and disruption. What we need in 2018? The Pantone Color Institute thinks whatever that might be will come in the deep purple hue of ultraviolet. It's color of the year, revealed Thursday. And it's very interesting. CBS News mainstream and it goes through the whole deal but it gets into you know the purple choice of Prince and David Bowie those can be uh, studies all on their own and their connections to the uh, the synagogue if you will they were club members they submitted they got what they seeked in this life uh, look at them all. Beyonce, Katy Perry, Lady Gaga, Da Vinci, all the purple people. Well, purple, really, from a biblical perspective, is God's color, really. That was the color of the, the curtain to the temple. Blue and purple and with gold. And, you know, man, of course, wanting to be like God. Now who do we see all the purple on? People like the Pope and prince and all these people who succumb to this world that's just the way it is and there was another article linked to this from this inverse.com here notice they have to have the inverted letters it's just crazy it's everywhere and so i'm just skimming through theirs and they just basically parrot the other guys but it's weird. Ultraviolet suggests the mysteries of the cosmo, the intrigue of what lies ahead. It's just uh, weird stuff, but they have a press release. So, you know, I click it, and it looks just like, you know, pretty plain corporate, you know what I mean? But I notice here, the Pantone color number, 183838. And we could go a million places with that. Ezekiel 38, anyone? Nothing going on over in Israel right now, huh? Not to mention this is also a 9 and 11, 11, double time. So that caught my attention. And what else I just had to be curious about was the actual company, Pantone themselves. Pantone. I get the tone, colors, tones, I get it. But Pan, I know what Pan is, and I don't think I can think of anything else. But uh, I'll leave a link to this, and you can start here if you want. But Pan was uh, basically a goat man. Yeah, he's, I guess you could call him an X-Man, right? Yeah, and he was an interesting character, and uh, you can do a read on him. But why else would Pan be there? It's not because of their name, because their parent company is X Right. Yeah. Go figure that. And their logo is the nice black box with Pantone in it. Just on and on it goes, right in front of our faces. On and on. So, yeah, I wanted to share some of this with you. And we could get into, and I just might, if I can, like cleared my brain slate um the relationship to the color purple in the days we're in now the woman was arrayed in purple and scarlet color mocking god this is when babylon falls all of it folks it's all there and it's a direct link there's no 
There's no way around it. It just, it's the whole thing here just screams, you know, where we're at in time. And to top that all off, check this out. And it is right, Gail. Four large fires are burning north and west of Los Angeles. The threat level index is red in Ventura and Los Angeles counties. It was raised to purple in some places. That is a level that has never been used before. CBS Evening News anchor Jeff Glor is in Shadow Hills where the. Never been used before. So, gee willikers, there you have it. So, peace and grace to y'all. Many fish. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God 